Yes guys, due to popular demand, he's back. And we're talking about three club golfer hacks that are gonna absolutely change your game. Okay dad, so driver, a bit of a hit and miss for you, isn't it? It can happen sometimes and can not happen most of the time. Um, so setting up the driver, we know the ball position has to be inside our left heel, right? Yes. But having it in the correct position is going to be hard every time, isn't it? It is. So what we want you to do is, so I know you've gone straight in with your feet open. Can you start with your feet together? Feet together, go on, feet. Feet together, who knew it would be so hard to put your feet together? <laughs> Line the ball up on your big toe on your left foot. All I want you to do now is flare your left foot, so turn your left toe out, move your right foot away. So straight away you know that your ball position is correct. So if you're set up correctly, you're more likely to pull the trigger and hit a nice shot. Go on, lad, pull the trigger, hit a nice shot, and we'll move down the fairway. Beauty. So ball position that's good makes a massive difference. Let's jump down the fairway. The second golf hack from the fairway. So we need to understand the concept of hitting down on the golf ball. So in your practice swing, Dad, I want you to imagine there's a virtual line extended from the golf ball all the way down. Now, obviously, drawing around, you can't make that line, but you can almost picture that. Yeah, don't, don't be doing that around. But make some practice swings, trying to feel out of bounds, inbounds, can we feel we make some practice swings where we contact the ground, just brushing it on the inbound side. So target side of that golf ball. So the golf ball is a line, make some practice swings, and just feeling as though you make some brushes of the ground on that target side. Good, okay, two of them before we go and hit the shot. And think about it this way, good. We're training a consistent bottom of the arc. We know if we hit down on it, we move that strike from the bottom on the leading edge all the way up to the center of that club, and it's a much better strike. Go on, Dad, smash this one away. Pure. Long iron as well, nice bruising divot. Okay, so the final aspect is something every single club golfer hates. We all hate this shot, but the pros love it. What is it? The shot I really struggle about the bunker is the long one. Okay guys, so long bunker shots, we know that they're really difficult, but what bunker shot do you struggle with? Comment down below, is it long, is it short? We'd love to know exactly what you're struggling with. So we're talking bunker hacks in two stages. One, specifically for the long bunker shot number two how we prepare it before we go into the bunker so dad come into the bunker so you've chosen your club we've gone for num point number one 54 54 now usually in a bunker you choose your most lofted club right 50, 50 58 56 is that most lofted club? Yes. I thought it was 58. Okay, so we go usually go our most lofted club. Now, most many of you actually carry a 60 or even sometimes 64. Okay, so we've got we've got not our most lofted club. Okay, okay. first point: long bunker shot. We want to put the same effort as into a short bunker shot, but how to make the ball go further? We use less loft. Okay. So lay the club out on the side. So you come into the bunker. I always then lay the club on the side. Okay, so let it open slightly, not all the way. Then take our hold. So your grip, this is the hack right now, your grip relative to you is neutral, right? Yes. Relative to the club, it's very, very open face. Okay, down to the ball now. We've now got our club face prepared. Just keep your hands on the club. It's open, it's already done. Dig the feet in more. Go on, dig the feet in, keep digging the feet in. Weight low and left. Where you start is where you come back to. This is absolutely key. Lovely. So how much easier is that? A lot easier. Because you just all you have to do is make the same shot and it's come out. Yes. So you're setting the club face up before you go out. And when you're in a bunker, on a long bunker shot, make sure you're using a little bit less loft. Thank you so much for watching today's video. Popular demand, he is back. Now, on this point, I think it's really good and it's simple things that are gonna improve your golf. Dad is a club golfer, just about crawling and hanging on his fingernail to single figures. So these things are really gonna help him improve and hopefully you too. Make sure if you haven't already, hit that thumbs up button. It really, I really would appreciate it. Dad might appreciate it as well for the fact that he's got more thumbs up on his videos than my normal ones. So guys, join the family, hit that subscribe button and see you soon.